Hello everyone, thanks for joining me today and today is day four of my Christmas card series featuring project or items from Honey Bunny's Treasures. I used the slide on over for this card for today's card and I used just the straight piece here. I used the Merry Christmas and the fox and the matching die. I also use the art glitter glue. This is awesome glue. If you are looking for this, she has it in her store as well. So let's go ahead and bring in my card. And this card I did in green and silver. Uh, I wanted to leave the fox white and then just add a touch of color to his scarf and the mug and then I cut the Merry Christmas out in green as well as one mat. So I only added a, I had my base card which is white, then I added a green mat and then the silvery shiny paper. I cut some trees out with my die uh, and um, if you have a punch or just some Christmas tree dies you can use that on the front. I did make a hillside here and then um, extended the second piece behind pretty high up so that I could fix the fit the fox on this slider track and he is attached to that piece and you just pull the tab and he slides right on over on this. You can also stamp a sentiment on this little track inside and then when you pull it you can see it here on the outside as well. So that's the outside of my card. On the inside, I just use coordinating mats in the green, the silver, and then the white. So that is my card for day four of projects from, or products from Honey Bunny's Treasures. If you have any questions about this card or any of the projects that I've featured so far, leave me a comment down below. Also, if you are not a subscriber, I would love for you to subscribe and hit that notification bell and that will alert you to um, videos that I have just uploaded and so you don't miss any of these card series that I'm featuring from projects or items from Honey Bunny's Treasures. So thanks everyone for watching. I did make a matching card as well, so in the silver, and I think everything looks really great together. Thank you for watching.